Hey everyone, my name is Olaf and today I'll teach you how to add gold, silver and bronze shaders in Eevee. As always, it's going to be quick and easy, so uh, let's get started. And before we begin, make sure to download the latest version of Blender 2.8, the link is in the description. Okay, so start off by clicking X to delete the default cube. And then go to Add, Mesh, and then let's add a monkey. And then click S to scale. And then let's add a modifier to add additional polygons. So click Add Modifier, Subdivision Surface, and then let's set the amount of subdivisions to 3 and apply the modifier. And we can also add smooth shading. So go to Object, and then Shade Smooth. Okay, so let's add the floor as well. So uh, go to Add, Mesh, and then add a plane. Then click G, then Set to grab the plane on the Z axis. And then click S to scale. Now, the next step is to select the light source. And then let's go into rendered view to see what it looks like when it's rendered. Now let's turn the light source into a sun. And we can also decrease the strength, so let's set it to 30. And uh, we should also rotate it, so click R, then set to rotate the sun on the Z axis. Okay, so now we have the basic light setup, so uh, let's select the monkey and add the gold material. So select, go into the materials, click new, and then let's uh, choose the glossy type. And uh, let's uh, set the roughness to uh, 0.15. You're obviously not going to get photorealism, but it looks good enough. And for the color, let's uh, get the hex code for gold. So go to your browser, you can use the link in the description, and I chose to use the metallic gold color code. So just copy and paste the uh, hex code into the material. And as you can see, we have the gold color. Now to make it look even better, we need to uh, add a background image. So uh, go to environment texture, and I click open, and then go to the link below to get a free HDRI image. So let's use the Chelsea stairs, which I like to use in tutorials, download it, and then go back to Blender. And then open the folder and select the HDR image and then click open image. And as you can see, we have the background image and uh, the gold material looks a lot better. So let's go into the render settings and increase the amount of samples to 300, both for the render and the viewport. And then let's enable screen space reflections for more accurate reflections. And the next step is to select the floor. And then let's add a material. So uh, let's go into the materials, click new, and then let's uh, add a glossy surface to uh, this material as well. And let's set the roughness to uh, 0.2, and uh, let's make it almost completely black. Okay, so now we have the gold shader, and the next step is to add the silver shader. So uh, let's select the monkey, then click Shift D to duplicate, and then click X to move the duplication on the X axis. Okay, and then we need to copy the material, and then just change the color. So uh, open the color, and we need the hex code, so uh, just Google silver color, and you can just copy the hex triplet, and then go back to Blender, and then paste the color. As you can see, we have the silver shader. And now we can duplicate once again and get the bronze shader. So click Shift D, then X to move the duplication on the X axis. And then once again, copy the material. And then we need to add the new hex code. So uh, let's go back to the browser. And then just Google bronze color and then copy the hex triplet. And then go back to Blender again and paste the hex code. And as you can see, we now have the gold, silver, and bronze shader. So let's select them all, hold on Shift, and then click G, then X to grab them on the X-axis. And uh, let's select the floor and add some walls. So go to Edit Mode, and then Edge Select, and then hold on Shift and select the three edges. And then click E, then Set to extrude on the Z-axis. The next step is to set up the camera. So let's go back to uh, Object Mode. And then click number zero to look through the camera. 
and then click N and uh, view and then lock camera to view and then let's place the camera in the front view so something like this and then I'm also going to rotate the monkeys on the set axis I click R set then minus 15 for the uh, bronze monkey and then R set then 15 for the uh, gold monkey you can also hide the grid and so on by going to the top right corner and disabling the overlay. So as you can see, the grid is gone. And uh, I'm just going to make a few adjustments to the placements of the monkeys. So you can click here G, then X to grab the monkeys on the X axis. And I'll do the same for the uh, gold monkey. And if you want to, you can also increase the resolution. So I'm just going to set a uh, 4K resolution for this image. And uh, then you can go up to uh, render. And then let's change the display mode to the uh, image editor. And I click render. And then render image. And after a few seconds, you will have the uh, finished render. And uh, that's it for this tutorial. I hope you enjoyed it. And I'll post more EVE tutorials very soon. So thank you guys for watching and subscribe.